at the time of this recording, it is Valentine's Day, and I am single as frick, dude. I think because I'm an introvert gamer that doesn't touch grass, I have this problem where too many women want my seed. My life is plagued with hordes of women, mountains of females, all piling up wanting to have sex with me. Yep, that is definitely the problem I have. At least when I come home, the dog is happy to see me. I mean, everyone talks about how dogs are always so happy. But I'ma keep it real, if I could lick my own balls too, I'd be as happy as every other dog in this universe. Welcome to Storm Edge. A name in this title and my favorite Valentine's activity consists of the same word. Storming. Okay, so uh, there's like a story in this game, but reading words involves a lot of thinkies in my head noggin. And that's kind of hard to do because I have a very small peen peanut sized brain. But the general cliff notes is that there's some kind of storm and it makes monsters and people don't like it. And you're looking for this guy called Bear. And Bear is either an actual bear or a very large hairy gay man. I think the former is more realistic in a fantasy setting, but the latter would probably be more fun to play. Not saying that gender identity or sexual preference should affect a character's individual abilities, but I will say that when I face a mini boss with massive boobies, I get the focus debuff, so maybe some of it does have a little bit of merit. Okay, we get a random lady at the end of this level. Hey, yo! Yo, 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 if you're watching this video, do me a favor, like, turn, turn around for, like, just a second. Okay, so I have been spamming things incessantly this entire time, but I think I, I cracked the code on how to actually play this game. So, bear with me. So, you have... On the right side, you have your little combos. They have fireballs. You shoot three normal fireballs, you get one big fireball. Big fireball do damage to yellow shield. But if you dodge things, you turn purple. And when you dodge things with purple shields, you can deal damage to purple guys. You also get purple ability, which is like a little a little cum wizard or something. It, it, it shoots fireballs for you, it's pretty cool. But if you shoot fireball and then you dash to do purple thing, you lose combo on fireball. So you can't just spam dash like I've been doing like a complete dongus the entire game. But you also can't move when you want to shoot big fireball. Okay, some old guy just gave me invincibility for like half a second after I dodged something. I was wondering why I was sucking ass this whole time. That was not on the Valentine special, if you know what I'm saying. Damn, I'm feeling good right now. Skibbity toilet, this guy's got some riz, yo. Grandpa's kind of jacked. Homeboy looks like John Stamos in his gilf arc. Holy. Santa on that Sigma grind. Damn, do I gotta clap his cheeks? Alright, give me a sec, let me cook. Alright, uno mas, uno mas, uno mas. I got this in the bag, yo. Look at this, he's already taking so much damage. Dude, my fire rate is bossing right now. Sheesh. Hold on a minute. I got to go scream in my pillow real quick. All right, we're good. I'll be honest, man. I didn't beat that boss because it was too hard. I just didn't beat it because I was bad. I just couldn't do it. You ever just know you can do something, but then you just are not doing it? Like I get equally as mad when I can't lick my own balls. I don't know what to tell you. All right, so it looks like Bear is an actual bear. He does look really fluffy though. I wonder if I can pet him. I mean, you could probably play him. I feel like that's a thing, but I don't know. I still want to pet him. He looks floofy. Now the real question is, do I get to respawn in boss room when boss clap my cheeks? <laughs> Actual roguelite mechanic, not tutorial. Oh, such an L, bro. Oh my god. Dude, these glass cubes are the bomb, bro. All you have to do is put your little fireball combos in them, and then they split your big fireball into like four big fireballs, bro. Shit kinda bus. Also, the more I play this game, the less stressful it gets. Shit. It's fine, it's fine. 
I've also got just a buttload of perks that make the game easier. Um, so that's probably it. That or I'm just so good at the game because I just absolutely annihilate everything I touch. So each room isn't like insanely hard, but it is very much time based. You see how this timer is going down in the corner? Once I hit zero, I basically get no bonus perks. Oh, dude. One second left. Not even close. So I don't get that chest, but I get that chest. Each of these rooms are pretty fun, man. Like these little snake guys that just gargle out this acid venom. I think what's also nice is I think traps actually hurt your enemies too. So you can kind of bait people in if you don't feel like everybody is just ganging up on you. Also, I just realized that the, the, uh, the rooms that say riposte abilities are just like your fireball and not your purple little cum wizard. So... I decided to upgrade those this time. I just got a bunch of damage upgrades. I don't really know. Also, if you shoot those little brown hot dog things, like parts of the map change, which is cool. I kind of like the levolution as you play. It's I, I hope that like post demo, they add some more of that stuff. It makes the levels feel more dynamic. Oh damn, don't all come at me at once, holy. Yo, take me out to dinner first. Oh shit. If I take more damage on this level, I'm gonna be kind of tilted. These vines are kind of annoying though. They just kind of stop you. I don't know how to evade them. All right, flower lady part two. If I can shoot her here, I take damage because I'm a ding dong. And then you gotta kill these little uh, these little plant glizzies in the ground. Yeah, I gotta kind of walk around. I gotta shoot this dude in the back. Everything has such high shields. All right, so her shield's broken. We're gonna do some G-clappage, hit the evade for a little cum wizard action, a little double tag team, you know what I'm saying. Avoid the stupid flowers, take more damage because I'm a ding dong anyways. And we have three cum wizards, she's about to get destroyed. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's how I, that's how I would feel too, if I had three freaking cum wizards coming at me. Alright, looks like we rescued the bear guy. Or not, maybe we just leave him in the woods and that's just where the credits roll.